Hello, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and today I'm going to share with you one of the most powerful verses ever given in the Bible. It is John 14:6. Jesus said, I am the way, I am the truth, and I am the life. No man can come to the Father but by me. Now, we live in a world of universalism, and there are many religions who say there are many paths to God. I remember one time I was buying some glasses in uh, the city of Yellowknife and there was a kind of a, a universalist Baha'i guy walked up to me and he we started chatting about who I was and what I did. And uh, he says, oh, you're the pastor of the church just across the other street. I said, yes, I am. He says, you know the thing that really bugs me about you Christians? I said, what's that? He says, you guys believe that you are the only way to God. I said, let me, let me set, let me set this record straight. I said, Jesus is the one who said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. We're only repeating the uh, message of Jesus. He says, well, that's pretty clear. I said, yes, it is. And then we started talking about the Lord. Now, all I did that day was plant a seed. But what I did that day was help that man to realize that there is only one way to God. You see, the universalists will tell you, there are many paths to God. I mean, there's Buddha, there's Muhammad, there's Krishna, there's Confucius, all these great teachers. But you know what? Jesus made it very clear that in God's agenda, there is only one way, and that is Jesus Christ. Jesus says, I am the way. He made it very clear that he was the only path, the only way to God, the only avenue to God. He says, I am the way. And we need to realize that. You see, Mankind, ever since the uh, fall, has been trying to regain paradise lost. We've been trying to do it through good works. We've tried to do it through religious systems. We've tried to make it happen through our own righteousness. There's one reality. We can't save ourselves. If we could have saved ourselves, there would have been no reason for Jesus Christ to come. But because we couldn't save ourselves, Jesus Christ came and gave His life. He allowed His body to be broken. He allowed His his blood to be shed. He allowed his death, his burial, and his resurrection. Jesus allowed that to happen. He says, I give my life willingly. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the way that God chose it, not man. You see, all these other religions are man re reaching up to God, trying to bring God down to him. And what happened was Jesus came and brought God to man through his death, burial, resurrection through his broken body and shed blood. That's how it happened. Jesus says, I am the way. I am the truth. One of the most fascinating uh, stories in scripture is that uh, here is Jesus before Pilate. And Pilate looks at him and says, what is truth? Here Pilate had standing in front of him the very personage the very image of truth. Jesus is the truth. And the truth is that Jesus came to give you both eternal and abundant life. I love John 10.10. 10. Jesus says the thief comes to rob, kill, and destroy, but he says, I've come to give you life, and I've come to give it to you abundantly. What a great truth today. Jesus is not only the truth, but the way and the life. You know what he says? He came to give you life, and he came to give it to you abundantly. That's the message of John 10.10. Jesus wants to give you life today. He's the way to the truth, and when you have the truth, you have the life. And so, if you're tired of this dull, humdrum life, give your life to Jesus. Let Him be the way to the truth of reality of life. And you know what? You will receive the abundant life that God wants to give you. You know, the Bible tells us that the kingdom of God is not a matter of meat but of, and drink, but of righteousness, peace, and joy. Today, God wants to give you righteousness, peace, and joy. He wants to give you life. And so today, as the message is, John 14, 6, Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. Let Jesus come into your heart today. Let him become your truth. And in that way, you'll have real life. My name is Robert Dean Steele. You have yourself a great and godly day.